So I wanted to come and do a quick update video on how we are doing. As you can see, I am not in my living room and I'm not in my bedroom. I am in my basement and I want to show you guys the area that I'm trying to get together for my little personal craft, personal space. So I still got a lot more to organize, but this is the desk. Um, this desk, this computer desk used to be upstairs and um, we got another one. So I thought this would be good to have downstairs to use as a craft table. So this is my desk. And like I said, I need to still organize. And then over here, I'm just going to give you guys a glimpse. I have more stuff. Um, this is a mixture of craft stuff and homeschooling stuff and pictures and just a whole bunch of stuff. So I eventually have to go through all of that and get it organized. And then I have this shelf here that has um, things from when Biggs was little, some little keepsakes, other stuff in the other drawers. But this is what I'll be working on is my little personal make, make area, um, a space where I can just relax, be creative, and um, enjoy myself. Uh, what's been going on guys? So what's been going on? We will be wrapping up the school year and You guys are gonna see a lot of this a lot of me pulling my hair. Um, I'm just really I'm really relaxed right now. So um, I'm just gonna give you guys a really relaxed version of me So there's gonna be a lot of me pulling the hair anyway or playing with the hair but anyway, um we are approaching the end of the school year and we haven't been doing much the last month uh really just reading and writing and math with little um he has been enjoying his snap circuit which i told you guys um in another video that he got for as a gift from his uncle so he has been doing that and then he was doing swim lessons um for the month of April and I can't believe we're going to be we're at the end of April tomorrow will be May 1st but anyway so he was doing swim lessons in April um we got a couple more homeschool co-ops we have three more and then our last co-op will have like a field day and a picnic and then um, we're thinking about doing one week of a summer camp for our homeschool co-op. So we'll see how that goes. Um, my husband and I will be getting ready to celebrate 12 years of marriage. So that's exciting. And what else is going on? Um, my husband and I are also working on a book um, about our oldest son. So that is a project that we've been working on for the last couple of months and we'll hopefully can have it done by the summer. So that's a project that we've been working on and have been encouraged to work on by um, a doctor that we um, know. So that's what's going on. Um, like I told you guys before, just trying to organize, declutter, and I really want to get a good start <laughs> on the decluttering and the organization before the summer comes in because I really want to enjoy the summer and we'll still be doing learning throughout the summer. Um, we just go lighter in the summer, but I, I think I'll never be one of those moms where we just don't do any type of learning. Um, it just works for us to do something. We won't do five days a week, but we'll at least probably do two or maybe three days a week. But um, so yeah, that's that. Um, I got a lot of videos to catch up on. I have not been on social media in a while. Um, just living real life. So I have a lot of videos to catch up on, and I hope to do that soon. So again, I'm just pulling on there. <laughs> so that's it. Um, you guys get to see a really relaxed me. I'm babbling. Um, really relaxed. <laughs> Next right now I'm giddy so that's good um, I think it's nice to show a different side of um, myself sometimes and not always the homeschool mom special needs mom but just hey this is me 
So that's that. I see you guys all again. I hope to be um, vlogging a little more this summer. I definitely want to do a video um, coming up in May um, before June. And it's, it's basically geared towards, um, it's basically some advice that I would like to share and some personal advice that I would like to share um, with families whose kids are still in public school and especially those that are getting ready to graduate. So look for that video probably the second week of May because I want to get it done way before graduations and all of that stuff just to, um, like I said, share some advice that happened with me when I was in high school around graduation time and with um, another a couple of other stories that I've recently heard about. So, okay, guys, that's it. I'll talk to you later. Bye.